Mm, he's already on my bad side. The episode hasn't even started. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Hannah. I'm your voice teacher. How the heck are you? I'm doing great. Thanks for asking. Today, we're reacting to more glee. Glee, 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 glee. <sighs> I recently reacted to some very uncomfy moments in Glee, and I was very uncomfy. It was a good time. You can check that video out over here. I'll link it just for you, babe, just for you. I've also watched two episodes. I've watched the pilot, I've watched season three nationals, and now I'm watching duets. I know, that's totally out of order, but I was recently interviewed on the Gleek of the Week podcast. Me, a Gleek of the Week. I loved it. It was super fun. And they recommended that I watch this episode because it has some great performances. This is season two, episode four, duets. Before we jump in, I'm going to pass the mic real quick to Ad Read Hannah to talk about today's sponsor. This video is sponsored by Helix Sleep. <sighs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't see you there. I was too busy luxuriating on my new Helix Sleep mattress. You've never heard of Helix Sleep? God damn it, you are lucky to have me. Helix Sleep makes premium mattresses and bedding that are customized to fit your needs and shipped right to your door. Which you guys know that I love because I do not want to go out there. There's people out there. Helix makes it super easy to get the mattress of your dreams. Take the simple sleep quiz on their website to match your body type and your sleep preferences to find the perfect mattress for you. And if you have a partner, you can even take the sleep quiz together to find something that's the perfect compromise for both of you. Because I'm a side sleeper, I like a medium mattress and I sleep alone. Ugh. Helix matched me with the midnight mattress. And because I'm a bougie bitch, I got the Lux. Ooh, Lux. Ooh, Lux. I've had my Helix mattress for a few months now and it's seriously so freaking comfortable. It's supportive without being too firm and it's a serious upgrade from my last mattress. Also, I love how easy it was to order. It shipped right to my door. Free shipping in the US, by the way. And I unboxed it myself. I was a strong, independent woman right over here. You can rest easy buying with Helix because of their 100 night sleep trial and 10 year warranty. And there are financing options and flexible payment plans as well. You deserve some bomb beauty rest. Click the link below or visit helixsleep.com forward slash fails to get up to $200 off your mattress plus two free pillows. Oh my God, guys, look what I have on my desk. It's a business Barbie. Oh wait, it's her cell phone. She's a CEO. I had to get her and put her next to my computer so that she could be an inspiration to me. <laughs> Are you ready for this episode of Glee? Whew. I sure am, let's go. Great voice and Finn heard him sing in the shower. And we'd like to talk to you about Glee Club. Finn thought Kurt well, was trying to look at the shower, the shower so he called him a name which totally got him chewed out by Kurt's dad. Maybe everyone should just start taking baths and that's what you missed on Glee. Finn called him a name? What does that mean? What did Finn call him? He better be nice to Kurt. Uh, dude, mm, he's already on my bad side. The episode hasn't even started. Bad news, guys. Puckerman's in juvie. Wait, what? Uh, who's Puckerman and why is he a criminal? We need his voice and his bad boy stage presence. We can't look at this as, as a crisis. Oh, oh, Puck. Puckerman. Puck. I remember. I remember him. Okay, got it. For welcoming our new member, Sam Evans. There he is. How's it going? Hey everybody, uh, I'm Sam. Sam, I am. And I don't like green eggs and ham. Oh wow, he has no game. Okay, yeah. this is gonna be great. What's a duet? A blanket. <laughs> I don't think that in the episodes that I have watched, Brittany has said much. That was really funny. <laughs> That's a duvet, Brittany. But thanks for playing. I'm making this a competition. What's the winner get? Dinner for two, on me, at breadsticks. <gasps> breadsticks, yes. Do they love, does everybody love breadsticks? Yeah. Are you gonna sing with Kurt? Ooh, Kurt, he's making plans, like you can just see. It's like a, a look on his face that's like a teeny tiny bit evil, you know? Like I wouldn't wanna get on Kurt's bad side, but also he just seems like he just knows the good goss. Yeah, I, I trust Kurt implicitly. I just trust him. Look, maybe at your old school you could get away with the whole I just stayed in the sun all summer excuse, but I have three gifts. My voice, my ability to spot trends in men's fashion, mm -hmm. and my ability to know when it comes from a bottle. I'll dye my hair, dude. Yes, you do. <laughs> but it's just between friends. That's not natural. I'm gonna go, because you're kind of freaking me out. Wait, wait, maybe my instincts were a little off. 
We are gonna win this. God, Finn looks so old <laughs> in that hallway of high school students. I love your sweet lady kisses. Mm-hmm. It's a nice break from all this scissoring. First of all, there's a lot of talking going on, and I wants to get my Mac on. She wants to get her Mac on, Brittany. She wants to get her Mac on. I'm only here because Puck's been in the slammer for about 12 hours now, and I'm like a lizard. I need something warm beneath me or I can't digest my food. Um, who wrote this? What, what, what are the, what words are coming out of her mouth? I'm confused, but also this is so rude. Was she, was she dating Santana, dating Puck? And now she's like, I just need something warm beneath me? Santana, that is so rude. I know I shouldn't use that word in your basement, but it's not like you were innocent. I really like you, Kurt. Did he call him a slur? Tell me in the comments if he did, and then I will beat up this imaginary character. I'm very upset at Finn. I don't even know what happened, and I'm upset. If he sings with you, I guarantee within a week, he'll take so much crap, he'll have to quickly club. Your call, dude. Okay, so Finn really is the worst. Glad to know I was right, as usual. Don't go breaking my heart. Oh my god, this makes me this makes me think of Ella Enchanted. This song belongs to Ella Enchanted. <laughs> the ending sequence is so iconic. Oh, I should react to that. Tell me in the comments if you want me to react to Ella Enchanted. Nobody knows it. But when I was down, I was your clown. So she's singing, I was your clown. Clown. It's pretty, but it's not grounded in her chest voice. And I talk about Rachel all the time because she's got a great voice. And because she's so great, I'm gonna be picky. Ooh, I gave you my key. Ooh, I gave you my key. That should be, ooh, I gave you my key. We have to have our chest voice on the bottom. Oh, oh, I gave you my heart. That's better. That's in her chest voice. I'm not really a nice person. I'm selfish. Self-awareness from Rachel Berry? Yeah, but I still like you. And you, you're, you're so kind and open. Uh, mm. Well, it's made me want to be a better person. Well, be a better person, but not because of him. Hi. <laughs> so, I just want you to know I'm really into you. Oh, Brittany's my favorite. I don't see the big deal. He emailed me like 60 MP3s of him singing and I thought it was Faith Hill. Kid's good. You singing a duet with Kurt is a death sentence. <sighs> okay, wow, yeah, all right, Finn. I think uh, you're a little homophobic. The doctors say you need to rest until your stress test. You're my stress test. Burn. <laughs> Yay, another song. <laughs> I love it. And it gets stronger in every way. Mercedes. breathe <sighs> I think I'm sweating I think I I have I have the goosebumps have the goose I have the goosebumps books they're all over me I'm sweating and that was so good I actually cannot function we have to listen to this again Santana sounds so good.
Stop, stop. I can't actually function. That was so crazy. I love the choreography. to put my mic down i have a very random question do the cheerleaders always wear their out their uniforms do they ever wear normal clothes i was a cheerleader in my day <laughs> i was pretty terrible at it but in seventh and eighth grade i was a cheerleader and you didn't wear your uniform every day you just wore it on game days so obviously i'm an expert obviously that was so good if santana and mercedes do not win In the shower. Why are they always talking to each other in the shower? What? Clearly, it's a trend. They're doing it on purpose at this point. Still problematic. Still creepy. Still not okay. This is kind of weird. Guys usually don't talk to each other in here. Well, this can't wait. Kurt, you look like Peter Pan with that hat on. An offensive song. Yes! Ready. Okay, they're going to do an offensive song. I am not ready i've asked a few members of the glee club as well as some cheerios to help me out how can you do a duet by yourself that's like vocal masturbation or something <laughs> vocal masturbation <laughs> vocal masturbation add that to the list of things i never thought i would say on my channel <laughs> oh my god i'm actually i'm not gonna say anything else about that a group of fellas found a new kind of music Look at that and cape. They decided that is to a call choice. it jazz. No other sound has what this music has. Oh my god, this is so fun. Before they knew it, what kind of music? And now they Kurt's play voice is just so smooth. From Steamboat Spring. I love him like gaining strength there. Kurt, baby, do that again. Only know it sounded right, so that is a great belt. That was a flex on his range, for sure. The problem with holding my mic, I can't clap. He did such a good job. I don't really love that song, but. Tell me why I should be singing with you. Okay. Well, I'm sorry. People say that I look like Quinn. I have to mention this in every Glee video because it makes me feel better about myself because she's really beautiful. Do I look like Quinn? Do I? Tell me in the comments below if you think I look like Quinn. Hey, when I begin to squeak, it's a cross between shriek, a, and a quiver or a moan. It's a little like a croak. What is this player. song what from? It doesn't have is oh, oh, I know you're thinking, what a crazy thing. But I really couldn't. Sing, I could never really. Sing, what I couldn't do was. Sing. Tina's got a great voice. I like her. What is that song from? Everybody, tell me in the comments below. I need to know. You tried to kiss her? Major Glee party foul, dude. 
I know yeah. I shouldn't have. No, she's just sending me these vibes. Those eyes. No, 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 no. I know I shouldn't have, but she was just sending me these vibes. She was just sending you vibes? Really, Sam? All right, well, now you're on my list. Trash. You might have to wear sunglasses whenever we're together. Good, because we're gonna have to spend a lot of time together practicing if we're gonna win that dinner at Breadsticks. Don't get it twisted, Sam. She just wants to win a competition. She doesn't want to date you. I mean, yet. Oh, yeah. Nailed it. <laughs> Nailed I'm it. sorry, I can't, she can't, I'm sorry. Um, why, why can't you do this? I really like Britney's wallpaper. I thought I was over somebody, but I, I still think I have feelings for them. Brittany, babe, what are we doing? Let me help you. I feel like she's self-sabotaging or self... What is she doing? She's like trying to get back at Santana. I mean, you're on the football team now anyways. <laughs> she, she's so strong. She made that look so easy. Am I about to lose my virginity? Before I do it. Before our duet, we're going to do it. Who wrote this show? <laughs> uh. Come give me oh. your sweetness. Oh, oh. This was in the Uncomfy Glee performances. I'm safe with you. All right. It is Uncomfy. More duets. More duets. Do you hear me? I'm talking to you. Oh, my God. This song was everywhere in 2010. No, earlier than that. Boy, I hear you in my dreams. I feel your whisper across the sea. I keep you with me in my heart. She's playing the guitar by holding it like this. It's like princess hands. Lucky I'm in love with my best friend. Lucky to have been where I have been. I do really like this song. Okay, this is adorable, but Mercedes and Santana have to win, right? They had choreography and a full band. And, like, panache. Stop looking at each other like that. I don't know, Quinn, babe. I'm just getting bad vibes about Sam. I don't know how to explain it. But actually, I just don't like any of the guys on this show, except Kurt. I don't know, it's kind of boring. She's using you for your voice. That's the only reason she has sex with you. Wait, how do you know that? Hi, excuse me, do you know Brittany? Sure, yes, Brittany. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had sex. Mm. Look, I don't mean to be a bitch. Hold on, what's with this? This is, this is, this is slut sh shaming. This is slut shaming. I don't like it. I'm not into it. Santana, you won't admit that you're in love with Brittany or that at least that you have feelings for her. You just said that she's a warm body. That's gross. Gross. I don't like that. No, don't say it's Quinn and Sam. And the winner is... Don't. Don't. Mr. Shoe, don't. two votes. Mr. Shoe. Sam and Quinn. What? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that. You know, I hear they don't even make these fresh. They buy them in frozen from some factory in the Dominican Republic. Crunchy breadsticks? No. You did all that work for crunchy breadsticks? Not even the soft ones? Rachel sounds really good right there. The the river. Soon your God. They're so stinking talented. Unison. And just get happy. You better change. Rachel's doing a lot. She's doing the most, but it it's it's paying off. It sounds really good. Happy days are here. 
That's giving me chills. Well, wasn't that just a hoot and a half? I loved all the songs. Mercedes and Santana were robbed. Absolutely robbed. Best vocals I've heard on Glee. Period. Point d done. Period. That was so good. Santana, Mercedes. Oh, oh my God, it was so good. I was a little confused. Where's that song from that Tina and Mike Chang sang? Can you guys tell me in the comments? And tell me, uh, am I supposed to like Sam? I don't know. Maybe I'm just in a in a protective mood, but I don't know. I didn't really like him. I didn't get, the, get good vibes, but maybe I'm supposed to like him. Maybe he's good. Tell me in the comments. Until next time, I'm Hannah. I'm your voice teacher, and now you're all my students. Uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. Follow me on social media if you want to, at hannah.bales, my Patreon, patreon.com slash hannahbales, or my merch shop if you want to grab a sweatshirt so we can be twins. Yep, that's it. Okay, bye!